Press options button. <laughs> oh, shut up, code masters see the EA influence has already started. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Dave live stream from the Elite Racing League, the elitist of racing leagues that you can get on the planet, yes. You can forget about your AOR because we don't drive backwards down the circuit. No, we drive, well we have enough problems trying to drive forwards anyway, so never mind going backwards. Anyway, here we are everyone, yes, it's round six, we are at China. Awkward! Awkward! Anyway, I hope you're all having a fantastic Monday into Tuesday right now. Yes, into Tuesday. It's another of those Dave live streams and it's going to be time for questions. And the questions we've got today is, well, the first one was, um, how did we all feel about the Alfa Romeo livery? Was that good? Well, it was pretty average as far as I'm concerned. It looked a bit like toothpaste to me, didn't it? Yes, too much white, too much white, not enough red. Anyway, that was, that was about it. That's about all the excitement I got from that, to be honest. But there's been more exciting news, and that is, of course, that uh, Mr. Mr. Bojo himself, Mr. Prime Minister Boris Johnson, sir, has... Um, told us our roadmap out of the current situation which uh, is apparently June the 21st when everything will be back to normal. No face wearing masks, no anything really. I think it's absolutely fantastic. I had no idea the virus was going to disappear by the 21st of June. Has anybody told it? Has anybody actually said to it that you know you should you should be gone by the 21st of June? Yeah, it's it's had its go. It's been here for a year and now it's time to bugger it off. Yeah, bugger it off because it's well outstayed its welcome, which it certainly has done. Anyway, so yes, um, unfortunately that means that people won't be able to put my plan of action into fruition, which is, as I say, about how to defeat this virus about digging a hole in the ground and wrapping ourselves up in cotton wool and we, no, we won't have to do that now because we've got the vaccine instead which is our um our road out of this yes and apparently after the two doses of the uh, pfizer vaccine uh, you've got um a 90 98.9 percent chance of full immunity yes which means you've only got a 1.1 percent chance of dying yes which is about the same as when you walk out the door to be honest because you know you could quite honestly get run over by a bus for 1.1% chance couldn't you so I think we're looking pretty darn decent at the moment I hope so anyway I hope that everything can soon get back to normal because I know that it's not just the financial cost that this pandemic has caused everyone but it's the fi it's the um, mental issues as well yes I, I have to admit even I've been feeling a little bit under strain these last well this last year to be honest not that I sort of worry about things like that I'm quite sort of uh, what can we say um, normal well I, I'm definitely not normal I'm very very weird but you know in as far as the mental sort of stuff goes I like to think that I'm on sort of an even kill an even kill yes an even, I don't know where I'm on an even kill too and quite possibly I could be sailing into the sunset of a complete mental breakdown but who knows but at the moment I think I'm okay I think I'm okay yes <laughs> <laughs> so yeah I know the strain has been enormous and of course obviously um, the death toll has been absolutely well there's no other word to put it really tragic to be honest I think we're on 122,000 deaths now in the UK from Covid so yes more apparently that died in World War 2 which is an even more grim statistic if you think about it yes even more grim statistic 
Anyway, that's enough of that. That's enough of this um, downbeatnessness. We need a little bit of cheering up now, don't we? We, we? we need some rebuilding. We need to start from the beginning of the game. Yes, we need to treat this now like it's the, 19, the original 1920s. Because if anyone remembers, when the pandemic ended the, the last time in 1918... Then we had the twenties, which was referred to as the Roaring Twenties, where everything started to pick up and everyone started getting happy and st all started getting home electronics in their homes, like TVs and radios for the first time. This was a time of good things for the world in general, and I'm hoping that we can get back to that. We can get back to that in 2021 and onwards and onwards. I hope so. Now, obviously, there's a lot of people out there right now who are in a very, very tough situation. Especially if you're in the hospitality sector or you actually own a pub, if they're still actually going to be open or even still going by June the 21st or anything like that. I know you're in a really bad place right now, but hopefully, hopefully, things will get better. And you know there was talk there was talk about there being a windfall tax for everyone which is what they did after world war ii in fact yes and and i think a few times during the 50s as well where basically um we tax everyone that's made a profit out of this pandemic so me personally that's got to be tesco's yes tesco's the robbing little bastards with their five pound 50 delivery charge yes they need to be taxed straight away absolutely yes i don't care you can now take me off as a tesco customer i don't give a shit because you've completely let me down this pandemic and you can go fuck yourselves tesco's 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 just send me those club car points you bastards <laughs> But yes, so Tesco should be taxed and anyone else really that's made a very, very high... And there's quite a few, there's quite a few, obviously. They should be taxed and then maybe a windfall tax just to, you know, just to... And of course, don't forget, if we get a windfall tax in the UK, everyone's going to spend that straight away. Obviously, we've been, you know, minding the pennies for a very long time now. Everyone's going to spend that straight away and that's going to absolutely supercharge the economy as well, which could be just a thing we need to get back on our feet obviously that is not going to create jobs and it's not going to give the jobs back to the people that, that are currently unemployed due to covid you know but this sort of boost could be just what we need to get back on our feet and we've got to really start to to, to build again build the country back to what it was it's from the place where it stopped in 2019 at the end to 2020 that's gone now that's gone that period of, of life that we were in in 2020 that's now gone that's never going to come back we've got to start again now and build back up to some kind of level that we were at before but obviously it's that's that is going to take a very very long time indeed but hopefully i think we'll get there i think we'll get there yes i'm optimistic anyway i'm optimistic as the uh, as the boss of the bloke who made the vaccine was it Pfizer said mankind has never been defeated by a virus and that is true most of the time though it just burns itself out but uh, this time we've had a vaccine for it but most of the time it burns itself out and don't forget of course we've lived with viruses for a very very long time I'm pretty sure cavemen had viruses they probably would have been you know the first viruses well not not well yeah the first viruses for mankind obviously but you know not the first viruses on the planet i expect the dinosaurs in fact probably had to put up with quite a few coronaviruses that's probably what killed half of them because that's that's my belief anyway i don't believe this uh meteorite stri strike in the earth was that wiped the dinosaurs out who knows it could have been a really big coronavirus like covid i mean you know dinosaurs wouldn't have been practicing social distancing would they no because they haven't got that mentality or brain have they no so yeah the dinosaurs could have been wiped out by a coronavirus back in those times. But I say the cavemen, they would have been exposed for the first time to these new viruses, wouldn't they? And so, you know, viruses have been around basically since mankind's been around. And eventually, yeah, we defeat them and they disappear. And then new ones come again. And hopefully we won't get another new one for another hundred years. I hope so anyway, because... I don't want I don't want this to become like a regular thing every what four or five years for viruses of this magnitude to happen. I mean, hopefully that shouldn't be the case. This should be something that we can 
we can pass on to our children in 20 to 30 years and say yeah well I can tell you a story about 2020 and 2021 when we had a virus called COVID-19 and we all had to practice social distancing and we wanted to stay in our houses that's something to tell your children and hopefully that won't happen again for at least another 100 years I'm hoping so anyway because the the cost to everyone has been pretty enormous right now pretty enormous and there are some real people living at the moment in desperate situations desperate situations but hopefully things will improve okay that's that's the end of the speech from Dave <laughs> let's get on now Dee dee dee. I'm a little bit late because I was spurting my speech there, but never mind. They won't start without me. Let's go and join. Let's go and join the lads. Dee dee dee. As I say, they won't start without me because, as we all know, every single week I am the star of the show, and they are basically just a complete and utter, 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 utter load of wankers. Hello, hello. Well, I'm sorry. I was I was talking to my followers, and I got a little bit carried away with my speech. Oh, talking to your robots. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, of course. Of course, you can. It's seventeen robots that follow. Seventeen me. robots. From Russian accounts. <laughs> hey, the Russians love me. I can't remember anything. <laughs> <laughs> mm. A penis. Well. <laughs> Grown man. <laughs> this is strange. Thank you, man. <laughs> oh dear. Oh no. I I know what picture is Ollie's talking about too. I remember it happening. <laughs> I knew it. Ex exactly, and we told him to get his clothes back on. Spinners. <laughs> There's video I think you evidence. Need to ask yourself that question, Joe. Because you were perv. We don't know the answer yet. I think you need therapy. I think, I think that's beyond a Dave conversation as well. Yeah. I for one do. No, but has the opportunity ever arose? No. Because I won't let it, because I've heard all the stories. <laughs> we can't spin if it's a rose. <laughs> 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 yes. <laughs> There's only a few cars out on track. We should consider getting out there. He 
He tried to. Fuck me. It's awful. Does the defense have anything to say? I reckon. Did he just whisper in your ear? Just imagine it's fake taxi. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what they're calling it now? Yeah. <laughs> we played our second game of Hide the Sausage. Shades of gay, but isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds plausible. Okay, the track is green right now, so take a few laps to get the tires up to temperature. Try and feel your way around. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm bringing child line. Joe, Joe's probably in charge of child line. <laughs> Thank for the attention. Maybe not the best phrase. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
Docker alert. Dave, how long into this stream do you reckon it was demonetized? Um, pretty much about two minute marks, I know that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we've done bad, have we? <laughs> Excellent. All of them, yeah. <laughs> I put it to the jury. Yeah, have you never heard of an abusive relationship, Joe, when the, the person being abused just can't let go? You know, you said. You know, you say, oh, he loves me, he loves me, he'll take me back, I'll buy him a bunch of flowers and the new F1 guys. I've been trying it. to fix Joe for the last 40 years. And, you know, I'm trying to stick don't, it out. Don't, it's don't, not, don't try uh, fixing people when you can't be fixed yourself. Oh! <laughs> that was an accident, that was an accident. I didn't know she was in there, I thought it was just you. <laughs> no. no, no, no. <laughs> you guys left me. We were playing Marco Polo and I had my eyes closed. No. We were playing Marco Polo, I had my eyes closed because I don't cheat when I play games, and every no, everybody got out of the pool, and then I opened my eyes, and Joe, Steph, Ollie, and Alex were laughing at me, and the, the only people that were in the pool were these, like, like teenage girls, and it's... Oh, no. So it looks well, bad it on paper, but it's an honest mistake. No, uh, no, no, no. No, that's not, that's not bad <laughs> My speedo. Actually, you know what? I, I had my speedo under my swimming trunks. And I'm glad I didn't take it. <laughs> no, no. None of that shit. Definitely. Yes. He's not here now. Where is he? Could be done with him. This conversation pops up. Just what?
I'm not defending anything that you've done, Joe. Oh, conspirator. Who's a coat conspirator? <laughs> what are the odds of that? My goodness. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god! There's a bottle of head and shoulders on the table, too. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> I don't know. Why have they got the pictures of you? <laughs> <laughs> A little loose with the clothes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that quote on my wall. I never put clothes on. That's just. <laughs> that's <laughs> Joe, are you a naturalist? Do you always do you always do you always walk walk around with your dick swinging in the breeze? <laughs> I remember that video being taken. <laughs> oh, Dave, you said you had a Medical Monday question. No, I said I was waiting for a Medical Monday question. It's your turn, come on. Oh, you're waiting for one. Oh, yeah. actually, I got one. Oh, well, um, there you go, then. So, the other day I was on the can, right? I was taking... I was, take, Hello. I was taking a honk in one day. Yeah, yeah. And and so I finish up after like a, a shit sweaty session, and I look into the bowl of porcelain. Oh god! Well, there's your first mistake. And, Never look in the bowl. Well, you, you have to look in the bowl, Dave. No, you don't have to look in the bowl. It's there's, where is there a law sure that, that says you have to look in the bowl? <laughs> Dave, you got to make sure whatever's coming out isn't blue. All right. So anyways, Hello? I, uh, <laughs> well, hey, for health, right? But anyways, I look inside, and it's like a freaking cannon, you know? It's, um, it's like, I don't know, it's it's a wide one, Dave, like, it's it's big. Has it, has it got so, some depth? It's, it's got some girth to it, so... <laughs> Anyways, Dave, my question was, 
um, I don't know if maybe a, you're more experienced with this or um, if you yeah I've always put a shit <laughs> um, how <laughs> oh he leaves right before the uh, right before how how wide can the human asshole stretch Dave <laughs> <laughs> Can I be the first to answer that? Absolutely, Josh, yeah. Well, I don't know how far it'll stretch, but if you take a too big of a shit, it tears your asshole and it's called an anal fissure. That's not anal a joke. Fissure. It's called an anal oh, fissure. It can tear your asshole. Ooh, I didn't have this... it, but made it, and it was fucking hilarious. I had to sit on a ring near the shit and sit down and everything else. You know, sit on a ring for about three weeks until it sewed itself back up. Oh my god! That yes, I had. Caused by a massive shit. Yes, I had one of those myself for fourteen. Oh, you had an anal yeah, fourteen months. Really? Man. Okay, and it didn't heal up, unfortunately, so I had to have it operated on. Oh god! Yeah, they said it, it was. Have to have it operated it so was. It was a. F I had a three three inch gash in my arsehole. Oh. There you go. <laughs> I I was I did I I it was it was basically my own fault. No, actually, it was entirely my own fault. We uh, an entire cow. No, um, I had con I had constipation, and instead of doing what I should have done, which would have been go to the doctor or go to the hospital, I thought no, I'll. I'll get I'll get this out. So anyway, I tried everything else. I was literally chucking laxatives down me, like left, right, and centre. But nothing was happening, and I could feel I could feel that there was a blockage there. You know, I could feel that it, it wasn't going to come out. And then eventually, after eight days, I finally I f I finally got it out. But I, I I pushed so hard I was like Elvis on the toilet. I could I could feel that I could feel that vein in the top of me head just about to explode and I was just but right God. right at that right at that second it came out and basically I just it just felt like this rip in my arsehole that came out with it and the pain was like astronomical uh, and then we try a salad it's and <laughs> <laughs> and then and then eventually after that after about three weeks I had to go to the doctor because it wasn't heating up and the doctor uh, had to look at it and his first words were Jesus Christ he says I have never seen I've never seen a fissure that bad and he actually said how on earth are you functioning as a human being and I said not very well <laughs> anyway shit. anyway I was I was put on the emergency I was put on the emergency list to have it sewn up and uh, unfortunately due to the uh, excellent medical facilities in the UK um, I was forgotten about and 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 so and so I had to wait 14 months and in the meantime they were doing whatever they could for me I was on experimental um, painkillers basically every time I went to the toilet I was um, writhing about in agony on the floor for about 12 hours afterwards this was back in 2000 2010 yeah, yeah. so but yeah, eventually. But eventually, yeah, I had the operation and uh, they sewed it back up, and uh, a couple of weeks later, I was okay. So yeah, there you go. So little moral of the story there: make sure you eat your vegetables. <laughs> have the soup, have the salad, and the steak. You I did. I felt sad too. Yeah, yeah. I felt. I felt. I felt sad as well, Joe, but that is a hundred percent true story and that's exactly what happened. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Listen to our younger <laughs> viewers. Eat your spinach. <laughs> he dropped it down the stairs. Oh. Or his, his um oh, Arch, Archie oh. dropped it down, didn't he? It was accidental, it wasn't on purpose. He's he's having some new flooring put in and Yeah, yes, yeah. yeah. He's um he's had some new flooring put in, Joe, and he he had the PS4 
uh, out of the way, you know. But unfortunately, Archie must have got it or something, and he he dropped it down the stairs. So it's 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 mm. done a it's done a hit all the way from the top to the bottom of the stairs, and it's got a cut of the what cut of the wires are hanging, hanging out the side of it apparently. So yeah. <laughs> He wants Jazz's attention, man, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm freaking smart, dude. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> You're right there, Mikey. <laughs> no, more, no more PS4 for you, you bastard! Bang! <laughs> <laughs> Won't play with me? Yeah, <laughs> Hamlin's daughter when she un like, turned that thing off when they were doing the e-racing. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> <coughs> that was Joe, that. Trying to get you back on it for, uh... <laughs> That's Fisher, man. Freaking nasty Fisher. <laughs> Rain. Rain qualifying, <laughs> dry race. <laughs> oh, shit. That's <laughs> my story. It got you, didn't it? Really? <laughs> <laughs> wow. What you got? Ferrari? Yeah, I ended up with Ferrari all the week, didn't I? Oh shit! Anybody else on the inters, or did you guys go for full wets? No, I'm on inters. No, I'm on inters. Okay. Shit! I hope it's not gonna get worse. That was what I've got out now. Dry race anyway. Catching you anyway, really.
There's only one lap of fuel remaining. Sell it. Come on. Move your car. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, I've got 0 0.26 in my tank. I'm just trying to nurse it into the, the pits here. I'm in sector 2. Just uh, I see there's a reno. Alright, John. I'm out of fuel as well, so I won't be. Ca I'll I've actually got the same fuel that you've got in the car. Yeah, I've got point eleven right now. Yeah, me too. Exactly. Point nine now. <laughs> Eight, seven, six, five. <laughs> That's it. Out of fuel. I do like that you can go faster in this game with low fuel though, it's pretty good. Yeah, I think in the old games, like, you had to crawl back to the pits. Yeah, you, 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 you could only get up to about 75 um, miles an hour. You could basically hold it up to 100 if you could, but this one you can get up to about 140 on low fuel. Dave, 
Yeah, I'll get a hot lap. Roger, I've got uh, Randy in front of me as well. Uh, I've pulled is over to the left. Is he a hot lap or is he... No, I don't know. Randy, are you in a hot lap? He's pulling over. No, he looks he's pulling over. Thanks, Randy. I'm only on a, on a slow lap, Randy, don't worry. They all do. <laughs> I'm hitting. Don't worry about it. Roger. <laughs> I can get a three second penalty. It's qualifying. It says three seconds. Sex Tim Pitts. We're now down to our last set of fresh intermediates. Oh, he's got a red card and I'll be able to see you. Engine fired, we're set. No alpha. Me and Ollie, Randy, don't worry. No one. Me and uh, Ollie have got the house, so we'll be hard to see other than that.
30 seconds left in the session. second lap in but uh wasn't to be but P three. Nice lap by Matty though. Oh missed the line by like ten seconds. I That's missed safe. it by one mate. <sighs> Tried to get another one in because I lost a whole heap of time at the uh, end of sector one outbreak to oh. the air being almost four tenths there. I went for two goes on my second tyres so I fucked fucked it up so I went low fuel mode for basically a whole lap so that basically fucked my my third lap up. Yeah. Good lap though, buddy. Ah, cheers. That was a cracking lap. You were hardly... I, I only got in through the final sector because I got the hairpin rifle and I caught you there. Everyone. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Restart, restart. I'm in a Ferrari. Restart. Oh, guys, I was in a Ferrari. We should restart. He'll he'll redo it if he gets crashed out in the first lap. I know.
So sorry, mate. My brakes are just. Yeah, okay. so, I don't know what's happening. I keep braking at the same point, but the cab doesn't want to do it.
pretty much burned off our excess fuel. We'll oh, be back on time soon. Don't wait too long to turn the engine down. Oh. I'm subscribed for the switch pad.
using a small amount of time to the car behind. Keep pushing. Shift up through the gears earlier, they think it'll save fuel. Approaching the pit window, you'll be on the softs. Expect the grip levels to start falling away soon.
we're low on fuel. Try shifting up the gears a little sooner. This should help us save some fuel. Pit window open. Let's box this lap. Tell him me to pit this lap, Randy. Strategy. We need to change to low fuel mix as soon as possible. <laughs> that something I don't already know. He has been racing oh me pretty hard with this whole <laughs> race. Remind us three fuel. <laughs> Alright, I think he'll get it all back in pit stop when he stops. <laughs> Okay, we've lost a position. That's us down a place. It's like I'm coming up for Williams going down the back stretch. <laughs> What's all that about?
in front is a second a lap faster. One second. Alright, Randy, coming up behind you. Just letting you know early. Hey Randy, just so you know, bud, you're muted. I'm gonna go to the uh, left here. Thank you. You're dropping a second a lap to the car behind. One second. Is that him? And it's hard to snap crack. That couldn't be. No way. Gap ahead is 1.5 seconds. Give me another mic in the pits, Randy. Can't hear him curse the chat, man. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Exiting the pits. Yep, yep. Ooh, look at that red thing. on, planning to run away from me, he doesn't know <laughs> that I know he's out of gas already. <laughs> <laughs> My crew chief told me the same thing. Thanks, Sam, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, Let's try this again. Can you guys hear me? Yeah, yeah. yeah. There you go, Randy. Much better, dude. Hey. 
Oh what do you goodness. think was the problem, Randy? We couldn't hear you for the whole I don't know what the race. hell. I don't know what the hell happened. Did I bump into the mic maybe to uh, mute myself or something? Or I don't know, but I can tell you this much. This thing almost came to a complete stop, and I saw Ollie come. I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> get the fuck going. Get moving. Let him go. I see a breath. I'm going a little bit wide, okay? And you got it. This. Since I've made the wing change, this thing is driving better. But it's been to stop. to shift up through the gears earlier. They think it'll save fuel. Gap to car in front is 1.6 seconds. So I had to adjust mine because this thing is just ill handling the hell. Crossing the line right now. Are you in the lead too? That's the flag too. I just wanted to make sure. behind you around there. I see you, man. Side around there. 
Faster than I thought they would. Like a lot faster. Well, we'll see with three to go. Because, uh, 37. Crew chief, Randy. I'm gonna drop like a last second. Yeah, that's left. Yeah. Right. Right. That's right, MK. This sad when we're on the mattress. I don't feel safe with that one. We'll lean it out for a minute. Guys, check your fuel. Mm -hmm. We're boxing this lap. Give us the best in luck you can. Yeah, me too. Lean that bitch out a little bit. Especially in these corners, these slow ass corners. That, that slow ass corner section. You know, I think I'm just been leaning it out a little bit because I'm like, okay, I got plus one, but I'm yeah. like, eh. I'm like, eh, hold on here. It's a bitch, it's a little mind, dude. Cruise is bitch. We can prove it. We have five laps of In the race, tires are starting there on the hard, and we. Let's strip. Play and race. Take it easy. Are you Matt? Yeah, he's not got a microphone, but he is Matt behind you. Oh, there we go. Hang on, let the Alpha go. Go on, Alpha. so you didn't lose out on as much time.
scraps of fuel remaining. of some tire wear soon, so stay on your toes. Detection zone was before the game, not like in the middle of it. Our gap to the car in front is oh, 11.9 okay. seconds. I say shit, mom. Don't tell me Dave Black you, Dusty. Any gas left, Dave? <laughs> Is that you, BLV? <laughs> Personal best, but 
the line were like 79. Hang on, Dusty. You want to go, okay? Oh, David Gomez. Gomez. David Gomez. He's about to run out of gas. I'm not that worried. Oh! oh. <laughs> I lost it. <laughs> Uh, I got too happy on that one, man. Yeah. Oh my god! I think that's his field goal, Gomez. Go get him. I no, don't think I, Gomez. Go get him, Gomez. My tires are all, all worn oh. out, man. Dave, <laughs> hold them off. Ah, good job, Dave. Shit, I thought I had you, man. Good choice, Dave. Sorry about that, Dusty. I didn't want to beat you that way. I'm Dave, not sure were you what spitting in your fuel tank or something? <laughs> no, I was. Oh, driver of the day. Oh, Yay! Driver <laughs> <laughs> of the year. Uh. I'll tell you what though, I'll tell you what though, Dusty, that's wow. worth a replay on my stream, I'll tell you. Alright. Definitely. Oh, Joe, you gotta, you gotta do a Scuderia Ferrari celebration. Oh, he left the mic, I'll tell no, him No, that. was, uh, that was fun. That was fun. Oh my god, I'm uh, sweating, like, I'm sweating like a pig here. <laughs> I don't even really know how I lost it, because I... Uh, you took it back in the hairpin, you ran me wide, but then yeah. I think I got on the gas too early while I was on the curb still. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened. And Gomez was right there, so maybe Gomez tapped me. Maybe that's what happened. Yeah, that's what happened. Gomez. <laughs> <laughs> no, I th happened, so. no, no. I, I was okay. nowhere near you guys. But, you, but you I was catching Dave. Oh. Well, I was I was a second behind you. It just felt weird, like all of a sudden I didn't have any traction and spun out. Wait until you watch Dave stream back and realize he just proper ass ended you. <laughs> <laughs> he did run me all the way off the road, but like he had the position, so he, he had the right to. I guess. I guess I was muted the whole entire t half the time, guys. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, it was very quiet all race long. <laughs> oh, I know. We missed you shouting at Jeff. No, oh, he was fine. He wasn't that bad. He actually helped me out a little bit. He actually praised me when I made that pass on MK. I had a good battle with MK, but it just yeah, we were going back and forth, man. That was cool. But the, but the car yeah, just good. went away. It was good. And I just I decided to put the downforce back um went the other way, and it got better. But you know, when I came back on Mike, the thing came like to a dead stop. <laughs> <laughs> and I was, I was going like, what the hell's going on? The controllers have been acting. This, these controllers have been acting really weird this week. Like, that throttle button is going on this controller because of twitching when I was fishing those couple months. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. In my case, I think me wire. dropping them and and what have you. But the worst thing is that that whenever I do the uh, do something, oh, the uh, the directional buttons will go ballistic. Mm. I think they're I think they're toast. I think I'm gonna take some tax money, take a little tax money aside and go buy me a couple of controllers and call it a day. Oi, Maria Giuseppe, Giuseppe, you got to do a scuderia Ferrari celebration. Let me hear it on the radio. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, what the hell? What kind of crap Come on, is you could do a little it? Sebastian battle. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, come on. I can. I can do, do, I can do one. Grazie, ragazzi. Yeah. Grazie, grazie. Yeah, baby. Si, si, si.
This Italian's actually pretty good, I might add. This Italian wasn't too bad. Oh god, come on, Joe. Uh, but that's what you meant it is, Joe. Oh my god, thank <laughs> god. It's already been made clear. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> oh, fucking god. <laughs> oh boy. Well, it's been a pleasure, guys, and I shall see you all next week. Oh, you I mean, know. I am beautiful. I am Reaper. beautiful, I know it, but I just don't need you to tell me that. Oh! Oh! <laughs> hey. That's it, yeah. Slide into I'll be up as well, guys, thanks. Josh, did he try to slide into your thanks, DMs guys. or what? Well, he went in rather too fussily, but yeah. <laughs> Hey Josh, how's it going? It's my dick. <laughs> oh. Yeah, take it easy. All right. All right. See you later, guys. See you later. See you later. See you later. Bye. It's been emotional. I'll be off as well, guys. Thank you for the race. Yeah, man. See you later, Great. man. Bye, bye, man. Bye, bye, man. Hey. <laughs> what were you going to tell him anyways? Write him a message. <laughs> Look good uh, to me. Starting grid random, overcrass drive. Oh, poor Jamie. Uh, yeah, I feel for him, man. That's just... Oh, God. Yeah. I think we're good. Yeah, we're yeah good, that was man. a... That was a PS4 Pro as well, Randy. <laughs> oh, my oh. God. Mm. Jamie. Archie. <laughs> oh, God. Oh God! What is wrong with you people? <laughs> oh God! Dave, guys, ready up, please, 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 please. My fucking day. Oh my god. He's sitting in my day. Fuck oh, yeah, man. Fuck <laughs> oh, yeah. Every Monday is like, this, oh. this, 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 this should be a great mood to go to work tomorrow. You deal with bullshit. You know that? I just want to say, you all put me in a great mood to go to work tomorrow. That's all I can say. <laughs> Joe told me that he shaves his cubes in the shape of a heart above his dick. <laughs> That's wild. <laughs>
Bang! <laughs> oh, no. There's a lot going oh, on right awesome now. awesome here. Oh, shit. Oh, Lord. Wow. We are off to a brawler. <laughs> I've been trying to other. spin around. Oh my god! Excuse me, pardon me. Oh, Dave's running away! Dave's running away! You're kidding me. He's gone. He's long gone. Oh, Dave's gone, guys. Fuck this. <laughs> You know, knuckleheads can stop me. Jesus Christ. Who wants to go after Dave? Who's fast enough to go after Dave, please? Okay. Ollie, go, go. You two get moving. Let's go. Happened. What the hell was that? <laughs> oh yeah, they are. They are. <laughs> yeah, awesome. <laughs> I'm going to do it. Yeah, but... I was down just imposed by my ear. <laughs> and Dave has gone. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. You can't play. Anyway. There he is. Oh dear, we killed him. Goodbye, Mr. Hook. <laughs> She here, picked him, man. She picked Carl. Wants a piece of shit. <laughs> Wait, Joe Lasers? What the hell? No! What the hell's wrong with you, man? <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Out of the way, please. Out of the way, please. Oh my god! Whoa, that was a good one. Go, 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 right, man. Go, 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 Seriously, that was awesome. Oh, Ooh, got it. Shit, going for the win.
Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh 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 Holy crap! You can't take it to the meltdown, <laughs> USA! Hey! Excuse <laughs> me, pardon me. That's another excuse for him, uh, for us to take more nude pictures of him. <laughs> Why do you get naked in front of guys? <laughs> <laughs> the only place you should be getting naked in front of is your girlfriend, your wife. Work it again. Work it again. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I have one question. Just one question for you, Joe. You mean Dom's ex? Is that what is that what Steph says? <laughs> Actually, so I, it I is think, what it is. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I can confess that I have accidentally gotten naked in front of uh, a cleaning lady that uh, came to my house. No, uh, <coughs> Dave, do you want the script? Seriously, what the hell is wrong with you guys? I, I don't get it. Well, no, it, mine was an accident. Joe does it on purpose. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> ready up, guys. Ready up, ready up. Ready the fuck up. Please, ready the fuck up. Please. No, that was an accident too. What? What the hell? What, what is wrong with you, man? No, you don't, Ollie. What? I don't even remember oh, a naked picture God. of me. Are you... No. Ollie, are you. No, no, no. Are you. <laughs> Are you talking about the, um, the Speedo picture? Yeah. <laughs> I've, been, I've no idea what you're talking about. Oh, 
Seriously, boy. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I remember those Hooter shorts. Shit! Hooter shorts? <laughs> oh, God. Good God, man. Joe, why are you <laughs> sitting like that in the car? <laughs> There's like no breathing room in there. <laughs> oh shit. Hooters, Hooters shorts, my Hooters shorts. There we go, man. That's it, just me. Damn. Done. <laughs> okay. Whoa, fuck it now. Seriously, the Hooter shorts were forty dollars. No, it's no, I can't do that. Yeah, like, you know, it's so awkward when you. <laughs> no, no, that's not true. <laughs> why why the fuck did he buy him for Stephanie? That's the question. Mm. Oh wait, I'm just gonna Well I mean I I did buy yeah. I did Come buy Stephanie. Uh, leggings. You're moving him, guys! Okay? Go! On the way. No, we're watching people. Watch you guys. <laughs> you can't stay. Oh. Oh my god! And he changes the topic, of course. He stopped. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you upset, Joe? Are you gonna cry? Oh, don't cry, buddy. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Who works it fast? Shove his ass off the roof. That's Jesus Christ. I get the Chinese voice. Chanti. Weird shit with a straw? Oh no. No, 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 no. Great work. That's a new fastest lap of the race. Yeah. 
I know, just tell the story how it is. Just tell it is. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> oh, mm. laugh. That's <laughs> true, you fucks laugh. <laughs> Dave, do you agree with me? <laughs> you fucks laugh. 
Got a pinkish hue. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god, Joe! Why? Actually, you know what? Wait, there's a... There's, there's a handprint on Joe's ass. And also, I, I can attest to the fact that I have about five pictures on my computer of Joe's ass. <laughs> Off we go. <laughs> But the thing is, he puts his butt in front of the camera, and I have no choice but to capture. <laughs> Not that close. They're getting mad. He's at his limit. <laughs> hey, Ollie. I think he gets some wax, really, but he thought, well, that's not manly enough, is it? So I'll just turn him away it lasered instead. <laughs> of it. <laughs> 
But does he got the win? Yeah. <laughs> this has got the title one. Zero. Uh, zero. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna say zero two on my, on my end too. <laughs> I don't now. Now, something I will admit. I guess it, do, it doesn't bother me though. Like it wouldn't bother me. I guess I wouldn't be in those situations. I, I would keep my clothes on most of the time though, Joe. That's what I'm saying. The prosecutor would ask. <laughs> oh boy. I <laughs> That's you can hear your wife. So coming. if you look at oh. exhibit A and rang the dog chat, you'll see Joe yet again making Ollie feel very uncomfortable. Thanks for no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> His wife's trying to like. That's his name on fucking night! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Damn! That made my night! <laughs> Her side, to be victim. fair, I uh, I've been in a lot of locker room situations and uh, traveling with teams in hotel rooms. We have like four guys to a room, and there's no one's ever taken pictures of each other. And you, you have to get naked in front of people, you know. 
And no, then no one's taking pictures. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Oh, oh, sorry, Dom. You're going around. Okay, bye. <coughs> <laughs> okay, don't worry about the spin. Let's just get back up to speed. Careful on the next few corners, your rears might be a bit hot. It does seem like the make oh. oh. Oh, wow, what the hell happened there? That was a little. I'm trying to squeeze for you. Yeah, I'm trying to squeeze for you, sir. Maybe your wife sent in this picture, Sally. Alpha, the same engine and everything. Huh? I got in. They already have pictures of my asshole. <laughs> and here lies the last week of the elite racing, <laughs> never to be run again. What happened to this League of Merry Gentlemen? <laughs> Why did we leave Dave off the hook? That's what I want to know. How did Dave get off the hook? <laughs> <laughs> He's just sitting there now. He loving every minute of this. <laughs> After the start oh. to Medical Monday, that was... Never thought we'd recover from. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, those guys are what happened to Dave? Dave, up there Dave, why are you down in six? No, I went, I went, I went into the pit wall. Whoever went by us. 
have pictures of me than, than my male, than any of my male friends. None of my male friends have pictures. <laughs> lady friends that I've been to with, college, Why is that scary? Friends, females have that. Have this. Alright. I don't have any pictures of my male friends. I don't, I don't have any I don't have any at all. <laughs> but lady friends are a story. That's another story. Joe wins driver today. Fine. All good. <laughs> Who doesn't have a section on their phone called Milk Friends? <laughs> I have five pictures named Joe's ass, one through five. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, I'm done. <laughs> I'm well, I'm doing it because I have to defend myself. Joe takes pictures of me and he actually records videos and audio clips of me. I can't... I can't wait till your mum finds those pictures, Dom. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I hope she never does. Oh she yeah, that would does. be real funny. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I wouldn't. I'd be mortified. I wouldn't laugh. I'd start crying. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <sighs> yeah. And the yeah. crowd applauds wildly. <laughs> I had <laughs> I had to salvage something from losing the day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh really? Dave's good at China, man. Dave beats me at China the last, like, three seasons, I think. <laughs> Set up by... Uh... I should have beat David tonight. I, I I lost it coming off two corners. I killed myself. I well, got it on exactly... the stream, Gomez. I did have the wrong setup. I didn't change... Well, I had set up three. I qualified in four, actually, and it was sta plenty stable, but... But I, I practiced in four, qualified in three, because it was raining, and then forgot to change oh, it back okay, to four. Gotcha. I got like eight. Of me? Dave, I mean, Dave will be uh, making a video. <laughs> Holy shit. 
<laughs> Holy shit. Oh, yeah. I like Brazil as well. What the hell? <laughs> 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 oh my god, no! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell did you guys do? Okay. Do it. I, I, is this on Facebook? I can't see it because I don't do Facebook. So <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Oh, my oh chest. boy, that was a 10 foot barge pole. No, it can't happen. <laughs> Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, God. <laughs> God, it makes you want to throw up. I don't even want oh, to know. Oh, shit. Glad I can't see it. I do not want to know <laughs> that at all. <laughs> what the hell? You're not missing what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> There's a lot wrong with you. Where's What's with the can? little uh, Sebastian Vettel icon? I'm <laughs> sad. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh shit! <laughs> No, <laughs> probably not. Oh man! <laughs> <laughs> I is just in brawl, I forgot about this thing. He's a bastard. He's. <laughs> oh, that's even worse, God. Joe, I don't have any sympathy for you anymore after seeing that one. No, Joe, I can't save you. I'm sorry. You're on your own, you're, man. You're, 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 you're ass naked in front of dudes. It's not even. There's nothing candid about that. <laughs> and 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 do you blank oh, out every time nearby. you take your clothes off? Is that what happens? Fuck. <laughs> 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 oh wow. Jesus, my <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah I don't have a for Joe anymore. So. What the hell? It wasn't like there's a candid shot where they're in the same room with you and they caught you naked. It's like you're taking your clothes off in front of the camera. <laughs> 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 That's exactly what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hey Dave, are you recording this? <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, even better. Oh god, it's even better. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh, I mean, there is a timestamp in the left, top right corner. It's not daylight. 
Oh, I know why, because this Hi is guys, a screenshot of all these times. I gotta get up time. tomorrow, so I'll see you guys. Oh, see you later, Gomez. Yeah. 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 See you later. Yeah. Take care, Gomez. <laughs> so wait, you put your boxers back on, looks like. Cause Joe, it's 8 3 o'clock where we are. At 8.08, you have no clothes on. At 8.10, you have your boxers back on. <laughs> what? Oh god. <laughs> sure, sure. Alright, everybody. Have a good night. See you guys next week, okay? Alright, Randy. Good night, Randy. See you later, guys. Hey, yeah, see ya. <laughs> I'm gonna blast to you later, fellas. Alright. See you later, MK. Okay. I didn't know it was a note that got a. Alpha Tori, right? How do you even explain that to somebody? <laughs> You're absolutely right. Why am I smiling at a naked man <laughs> showing me his rear? <laughs> to be fair, Dustin, like he had just popped on the screen. <laughs> All right, I'm getting out of here. See ya later. Bye-bye.
Thanks to everyone in the party tonight. You've been awesome as always. And I'll be back on Thursday with another video. Yes. F1 2014. Oh, God. Thank you, everyone. And good night. <laughs>